Hi, I'm Cassie, and this is Surprise Let's Play. And I was awoken from my almost slumber from Ella, which is one of my favorite followers. Um, she told me that there was a Rainbow High episode out, and I know there has been a Rainbow High episode out. I've just been a little apprehensive with their videos. Um, they keep reporting me. So, like, I mean, every time I put out a video with this, they report me and I have to send out an email and work through it. And I think like two, I'm two videos behind of reporting and you guys have already watched them. So I'm not going to get paid for it. So I do these videos for you because I love you and I know you like watching them. So I hope you enjoy this episode. I hope you watch it with me and we shall see what's going on. I don't have coffee. I don't have tea. I don't have water. So let's see what's going on. So, all right. Welcome to Project Rainbow from beautiful Malibu Beach! We know our hard-working contestants deserve a day to bask in the sun. <sighs> I know this. But sun time doesn't necessarily mean fun time. It's a new day, which means a new challenge. Oh, of course it does. Know. To guide us to your next challenge, the creative energy behind all things Project Rainbow, Maria, Maria Garcia. Garcia! Hello all! I can't wait to see how this new environment will spark new creativity in you. And to decide today's challenge, the return of our color wheel! Shipped all the way here from Shadow High. <laughs> okay. This is cool because on the rainbow side, there's Sunny, and then on the shadow side, there's Luna. How fitting! For this week's challenge, each team will create a piece inspired by where you are. The ocean! You will be working outside under the beautiful blue Malibu sky. Walking outside? What if our materials get wet? Or sandy? Each team will choose an object that invokes the ocean to inspire their garment. And you will, of course, be using the official Project Rainbow sewing machine. I am sick of the sewing machines. We have so many. We just got a Skylar with a sewing machine, and I haven't got her yet, but I did order her, so stay tuned for a video of her. Comment below if you want to see it. Um... Let me know if you want to see that video. So anyway, without further ado, let's just see what they're going to do. They're extra sparkly in the sun. And this week's team leaders are from Shadow High, Monique. And from Rainbow High, Michelle. Monique and Michelle will pick their team's blue ocean inspiration. I'll be back later with a surprise guest judge. Got it, a starfish. It's dynamic, multidimensional, and glamorous. What is a starfish anyway? I'm pretty sure it's not a fish or a star. <clears throat> okay, <laughs> I'm here, I'm here. I just, it's taking me a moment to understand why she has no idea what a starfish is. Maybe she's in the middle or, you know, not in the like areas where there's water. <sighs> How does she not know what a starfish is? She's on an island. A sand dollar? Real, right? It's <laughs> very flat and beige and basic. I'm so glad I have immunity this week. Get it together, Shadow High. There's so much to be inspired by. I'm already buzzing with images of haute couture and dollar signs. Come on, Shadow High. We got this. Sand dollars are fetch. 
My mom brought me one back from her trip. Ah! It's fetch. Dun, 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 dun. The kids heard what fetch is. Oh, no, I'm sorry. I'm just. Uh, I hope Malia picks that up. That's so cute. That's so fetch. I don't know. Maybe she's not going to pick it up. But anyway, it was happy for me to hear. So sorry, I paused it. Let's go. To Hawaii, and I always keep it in my room for good luck. I know we're all bummed we aren't here to relax, but let's get pumped for the amazing work we can do. Oh, I just don't see how this is going to inspire a trailblazing garment. Starfish are amazing. When I was little, my favorite part of snorkeling was finding a whole bunch of purple ones on a reef. Oh, yeah. When I was younger, I used to draw starfish all over my school notebooks. So cool how each of their arms has an eye. So they can, like, see people watching them from all angles? Useful. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I want to contribute, but I'm just tired and feeling so uninspired. Maybe I should throw in the beach towel and go home. I don't remember what her name is right now, but comment below what her name is. The Australian girl. I don't know why I don't remember. It's looking incredible, team! A jumpsuit, bold choice. We were inspired by the structured lines of the starfish's arms. But as it is right now, the suit looks a little off the rack. <gasps> Make sure it says high fashion runway, not work day at the beach. Totally. You heard her. We need runway wow. Victoria, you okay? I'm sorry. I'm just feeling creatively blocked. The creative life is full of challenges. When I'm feeling stuck, I find it best to step outside the box and try to see the challenge with new eyes. I'll try that. New eyes. Eyes! That's it! <laughs> Chanel, you reinforce the seam. Tris is missing something. Hmm. A little extra pizzazz. Oh, I've got it. A train. A train? Like a wedding dress? No. It'll be a long blue train. It would really show we're inspired by the week's theme. Hmm. It could work. I would suggest some hand-beaded embellishments. But I'm exhausted. And that's a lot of extra work. So if Rex wants to do the work, I say add whatever. Sewing needles down. Time's up. I promised you a fantastic guest, and so please welcome Pacific Coast High Zone, Finn Rosado. I cannot wait to see what ocean-inspired garments you've created. Lame ruffles? Clever! Workwear with a runway flare. I feel sandy just looking at it. But like, uh, in a good way. <laughs> oh. Uh oh. Rainbow High? You created a versatile garment that works for both work and runway. Victoria, your golden pop really made a star of this starfish. So congratulations, Victoria, you are today's winner. Unfortunately, Shadow High's ocean-inspired train metaphorically fell off the tracks and literally fell off the dress. While Rex had the last minute idea to add it, he has immunity this week. So we have to send someone else home. And that person is Carla. You agreed to an idea you didn't like simply because you were too tired to put in the extra effort on an idea that could have saved your look. Please. Uh... That wasn't fair. Grab your backpack because you're returning to class. 
I'm so sorry, Carla. It's all right. You tried Bye, your best. Carla. <laughs> Way to save the design, Victoria. I finally figured out how to see things from a new angle. <laughs> <laughs> well, it looks like the team's had a great day in Malibu. But now it's time to go back to the Project Rainbow workshop. See you all next time on Project Rainbow! All right, I really liked that episode. It was really cool. Um, I don't want to say it was lackluster tonight because it wasn't. It was a little exciting. I did not know who was going to go home. It was kind of messed up that Carla went home, but whatever. Um, anyways, if you liked my video, comment below and click subscribe. I love you guys. Bye.